Hi beautiful friends, it's Laurie here from Lemon Yoga and welcome back to another morning routine with me. Today I'm taking you through some of my favourite morning energising stretches to wake you up and leave you feeling ready for your day. So give this video a quick thumbs up, hit subscribe to join the Lemon Yoga family and then come and meet me on your mat. Let's begin in a wide leg child's pose, melting the belly towards the ground and reaching the arms in front of you. We'll wiggle the hands over to the right hand side, placing the left hand on top. Gently press the left hand away, stretching through the side of the body. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. And breathe out. We'll begin to release, going to the other side. Right hand on top this time, the right hand gently pressing away, finding that big stretch through the right side of the body. Tuning back into the breath, breathing deeply into the body. Feeling the whole side of the body stretch and awaken. Release back through centre and rise through all fours for cat cow. On your inhale, dip the belly, lift the heart space. And on the exhale, round and look to the knees. Inhale, rolling forwards. Exhale to peel the body back. Inhale, forwards again. Exhale, peel back and just keep that coming for a few more in your own time, really focusing on releasing through the whole spine, taking those big full body breaths in and out. When you're ready, find neutral, toes together, knees wide, reach the left arm up high and thread the left arm under the right for a twist. Now reach that right arm away, look under the right arm towards the ceiling. Lift your tailbone high to the sky. Stay with your breath. Let the whole body stretch and open here. Press your right hand to the mat, rise, and then reach your right arm high, right arm under the left. Walk that left hand away. Look under the left arm towards the ceiling and focus on lifting those sit bones high to the sky. Breathe in and breathe out. Keep lengthening through the back of the body. Exhale to release, rise back through. This time place your forearms to the mat, melt the hips and find your sphinx pose, lifting the chest towards the front of the room. Draw the shoulders back, lift and open your heart space. Feel that gentle stretch in the back. And then kick your right foot in, grab hold of the right foot and gently press your foot towards the bottom. Hold it there, breathe. Stretching through the front of the leg, release, other side. Grab hold of that left foot and gently pull the left foot down towards the bottom. Breathe, let the body soften in the stretch. And then when you're ready, release, let it go. Back into your sphinx for a moment and then palms to the ground, press and rise, downward facing dog. Full body stretch, lift those hips high, pedal through the feet, relax through the top of the head to lengthen all the way through your back and take deep breaths in and out. Holding still, we'll reach the left leg towards the ceiling for three-legged dog. Find that length, find that space.
from there, the left foot steps on through, we land the foot to the ground, back foot to the mat, lengthen through the back of the left leg, lengthen through the spine for your pyramid pose. And then let yourself fold over the left leg and breathe. The head hangs heavy. Softening all the way through the back of the leg, all the way through the spine, right into the top of the head here. Breathing in. And out. Inhale. And then as you exhale, open into Trikonasana, lengthen through both legs, left hand down, right arms reaching high. The eyes can look up towards that top hand. And just stay with the breath here. Keep lengthening. Breathing into the stretch. Reach your top arm, that right arm, all the way up and over now until it's diagonal, diagonal, parallel to the floor. And then come all the way round and down for a wide leg forward fold. Elbows melt towards the ground. If you can, pop the top of the head to the mat, but don't force it. It won't be in all of our bodies. You can always soften into the backs of the knees here if you need to. Otherwise, try and keep the backs of the legs straight. Gently drawing the torso closer and closer to the legs. Breathe. Walk yourself back round to the top end of the mat, bend into the left knee, eyes look forwards, press it back, downward facing dog. Stretch through the back of the body. Roll forwards, melt the hips, lift the heart space, find upward facing dog, a big back bend. Keep drawing those shoulders back, open the heart space. Tuck your toes, press back, downward facing dog. The right leg lifts, three-legged dog, find that length, find that strength all the way through the back of the body. Keep pressing the ground away from you here. That right leg steps through, place the left heel to the mat, lengthen through the back of your right leg, find your pyramid pose, lengthening the spine, flat back. Stay here as long as you want or fold the body all the way down. So now the crown of the head is really heavy. The spine is soft and relaxed and you're gently drawing yourself closer and closer to that right leg without any force. Deep breaths here. And then we'll begin to open for our triangle pose. Right hand down, left arm reaching and sweeping high. The eyes look up towards that top hand. Fine length through both sides of the body, all the way through the inner thigh on that right leg. And then just breathe into the stretch. Reach the left arm up and over until it's parallel to the floor, extending further into the side of the body. And then we'll come straight down into low lunge this time, bend into the right knee, eyes look forwards, press it back, downward facing dog. Rolling the knees to the ground, hips down to the feet and back into your child's pose. Taking a moment here to rest and breathe. Take big breaths in and out. And then we'll begin to rise on up so we can come all the way down onto our back. So just gently making your way there for a twist. The knees drop to the left hand side, left hand to the top knee, right arm reaching away. Look over that right shoulder and let yourself melt. Stay with the breath here. Big breaths in and out. And just let the whole of the back of the body melt towards the ground. Stay with your breath. 
Gently release and go the other way. Knees to the right, right hand to the top knee, left arms now reaching away, look over that left shoulder. Breathe deeply as you let yourself melt towards the ground. Big breaths in and out. Body becoming heavier and heavier. Keep melting, keep breathing. Allowing yourself to unwind and relax. Release through center, draw those knees to chest, gently rock the body from side to side, giving yourself one last massage before taking a moment in Shavasana. So get yourself comfortable on your back, either with the legs long or knees bent, and just begin to focus in on the breath, taking a deep breath in, and out and on every exhale the body is becoming heavier and heavier this is your time your time to relax and switch off your time to do absolutely nothing before you move on with the rest of your day so you could press pause now I want to take a moment to say thank you so much for joining me for today's morning yoga stretches. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment and of course hit subscribe to join the Lemon Yoga family. I would absolutely love to have you here. Take your time to come out of the pose rolling to seated and maybe reaching the arms up high bringing those hands down to your heart space i'll see you soon for the next one take care bye guys mm -hmm.